If you've been waiting longer than usual on a COVID-19 test result from a state-run test site in Rhode Island, you're not alone. 12 News reporter Alexander Leslie joins us live in studio with the latest details from the Department of Health. And Alex, the DOH says this stems back to a laboratory equipment issue from right around Thanksgiving, right? Yeah, so after some of you told us you've been waiting longer than the usual one to two days for results, some a week or more, I took those concerns to the Department of Health last Monday. Dr. Philip Chan told me that was supposed to be fixed by the middle of last week. There may be some delays with testing through the state sites by a day or two. So just asking people for their patients who are on it, we're working on it, but please make sure to take that into account, certainly for any travel plans. So we checked in with the DOH again last night and a spokesperson told us while the equipment issue has been resolved, there is a lengthy backlog of tests to get through. The spokesperson tells us a number of long term care facilities are also seeing case increases right now, which requires a lot of testing and testing in those outbreak scenarios gets prioritized. Now, the issue is only affecting PCR tests at state run sites, not the rapid test, and the DOH website still says to expect results in 72 hours. If you're in need of a test, you can always try your local pharmacy or big box store for an at home test. Live in studio, Alexandra Leslie, 12 News.